Hello everyone, my name is Alexa and I am the Assistant Head of the Digital Services Department at the Niles Main District Library. Today we are going to be using the tools and skills in the Silhouette Studio software to design our own football and fall themed mason jar. Let's get started. Before we get started designing, we will need to download a bit of software. On any browser connected to the internet, go to the website www.silhouetteamerica.com. On the website's homepage, to the left of the search bar, you will see a blue button that says Software. Go ahead and click on that button. There are links on the software page that allow you to download the free Silhouette Studio software for either a Mac or a PC. Once you have the Silhouette Studio software downloaded and opened, we can get started. The Page Setup panel usually opens by default and allows you to set up your workspace. For this project, your width should be 5 inches and your height should be 4 inches. To start our design, we are going to add the word football. Use the font tool on the left side panel and start typing in your workspace. Type the word football. To change the font, highlight the word by clicking and dragging over the letters. Choose a font for your word by selecting the font tool on the right side menu. For this example, we are going to use the font Sign Painter. You can see that some of the letters overlap. This means that they will cut out individually, and that's not what we want. To remedy this, we are going to weld our letters so it cuts out the word as a continuous image rather than individual elements. Highlight your word, then right click and select Weld. Select the entire word, right click, and choose Group. This ensures all the letters become one unit. Grouping makes it easier to move or resize the element. Next, we are going to add the words Fall Y'all to our design. Use the font tool on the left side panel and start typing into your workspace. Highlight your words before choosing a font in the font tool on the right side menu. Just like with the word football, we are going to use the font Sign Painter. Just like we did for the word football, we are going to weld our letters so it cuts out the words as a continuous image rather than individual elements. Highlight your words, right click, and select Weld. Just like before, we're going to group our letters so they become one unit. Select all of Fall Y'all, right click, and choose Group. Next, we are going to add the word AND to our design. Use the font tool on the left side menu and start typing in your workspace. Highlight the word to change the font by using the font tool on the right side menu. For this design, we are going to use the font Andel Mono. Find a black and white leaf image from Google. Right click on the image to save image as to your desktop. In Silhouette Studio, go to File, Merge, and find the leaf image on your desktop to add it to your workspace. Now we need to trace the image so it is ready to be cut. On the right side menu, choose the Trace Panel tool and then select the Select Trace area. Click and drag to draw a box around the leaf so it turns yellow. Click Trace from the Trace Style options. A cut line will appear along the outside of your image. Drag the original picture out of the work area and delete it. Next, find a black and white football image from Google. Right click on the image to save image as to your desktop. In Silhouette Studio, go to File, Merge, and find the football image on your desktop to add it to your workspace. Trace the football image by selecting the Trace Panel tool on the right side menu. 
Then select Select Trace Area. Click and drag a box around the football. Click Trace. Drag the original picture out of the work area and delete it. Now that we have all of our elements, we can start resizing the design. Click and drag the grabbers along the outside of the images to move and resize as needed until you are happy with your final layout. Once you've completed your design, you'll need to cut it out on a Silhouette Cameo Cutter. Weed the design carefully before applying it with transfer paper to a mason jar. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, you can call the Digital Service Desk at 847-663-6606 or use the chat feature on our website at www.nileslibrary.org.